Your experience with limb loss is unique and personal. Each day has its challenges. Among them may include struggles with balance and mobility. I'm going to teach you how to do a simple exercise that can increase your strength, balance, and confidence in your prosthesis. Hi, I'm Dr. Carol Miller, and I'm a professor of physical therapy at the University of North Georgia. I've been working with amputees for 30 years, helping them live full and productive lives with limb loss through regular exercise. You've heard it before, exercise is important to a healthy lifestyle. Without it, you can become more susceptible to illness and disease. The concern is that having an amputation for a long period of time is associated with secondary physical conditions including osteoarthritis, back pain, and other musculoskeletal problems. Being more physically active and doing regular exercise, especially as an amputee, can help you to be less prone to orthopedic injuries and reduce your risk of falling. I know it can be difficult to maintain a regular exercise program after physical therapy or rehabilitation. So here's a simple exercise you can do from home. The ball rolling exercise addresses two important aspects for using a prosthetic limb, proper standing posture and balance. Before you can better control your mobility, you need to build confidence and trust in your prosthesis. Feeling stable while standing is the first step to good walking. In addition, the ball rolling exercise helps you to identify any issues with a prosthesis that needs adjusting. Now, let me show you how to get started. You may want to do this exercise near a countertop, table, or chair for support, which can prevent falling. To begin, I recommend using a small ball. Place the ball on the ground under your sound limb. Put your foot on the ball and stand straight up for good posture. Next, roll your foot on the ball in a forward and backward direction. You will feel the muscles in your amputated limb flex and relax. Not only are your muscles developing strength, you're building muscle memory. As your foot rolls on the ball, your muscles begin to learn how to function with your prosthesis. Next, roll the ball in an inside circle, then reverse the direction of the ball. It's important to focus on proper form and good posture when doing this exercise. Stay focused and move with controlled motions. Start with 10 repetitions of each exercise component once per day. Gradually work up to 30 repetitions for each component twice per day. Counting out loud during each exercise will also help you use proper breathing techniques for greater efficiency. Nine, ten. To begin, you may need to use two hands for support. As you become more confident, progress to using one hand, and eventually with no hands for support. To make the exercise more challenging, you can also use a larger ball. Before beginning this exercise, seek permission from your physician or a trusted healthcare provider regarding your specific needs and guidelines for exercising, and especially if you have not been following a consistent exercise routine. Remember that exercise does not have to hurt to be beneficial. Overstressing your muscles and joints may not be realized until the day after your workout. And always remember to be safe to avoid injury. By doing the ball rolling exercise, you will develop good posture, strengthen the muscles in your amputated limb, gain greater balance, and build confidence in using your prosthetic limb to live a full and productive life with limb loss. If you're ready to take the next step, Check out our video on mobility control with another simple exercise you can do from home.